Oh man, that is awesome. Let me get that. Okay. Let okay. me get a fresh one. Yeah. Right, there we go. Uh, uh, just throw it in and it'll shrink away. How did you get started? So, I'm Corbin Griffith. I've been building things since I was a little kid. I uh, started out in my parents' basement with this thing. I really like the design of the Nintendo Light Zapper. So, this one I've retrofit to uh, light up. <laughs> uh, shoot, vibrates. That's how I got involved in plastics. Um, the love of that spread to mechanical engineering school. Started building sculpture right out of school. All my work's up here. Um, and then, you know, just through friends, I found contacts that we need a display case for our interactive video. Uh, this is Play Motion, based in Atlanta. Uh, a really cool company. Um, got hooked up with Red Bull. Um, I built them interactive uh, video game marketing devices. So we've got 20 of those in the world. Um, they just pulled up, ready for trade show. Um, all my sculpture works over here. Um, let's see here, where's a good one? This is another Red Bull thing. This is like a road case that turns from a, just a road case for shipping into an interactive, ready to go living room. Um, sculpture in the past, Temple of Gravity. Current work with the treehouse. Steampunk treehouse. Sean Orlando's working on that. Colossus, 2005. Large scale kinetic spinning sculpture. Um, a wind powered kinetic. This is beautiful, it moves all the time. Wow. Product design, process. And this is what we did last year with Michael Christian. Uh, this is called It. It's a big spider bug. Where did you demo it? Um, it's been at Coachella and it's been at Burning Man. Okay. So do you find a lot of places that you guys can show what you do? I'm kind of a work for hire guy. So yeah, hire me if you want something built. Um, I work for the sculptors, you know, super low hourly rate. Um, I built I built those out for Red Bull at a fixed price. And play motion the same way. I've, I've been pretty busy lately. It's been good. It's been a good year. Yeah. Okay. Nice. So do you find that, what's the hardest thing for you? Like, is it to hold focus or like there's too many things to try and do? Or what, the hardest the thing is the low point when I have like nothing to do for a month. Um, I go crazy. Okay. Absolutely crazy. <laughs> um, is and that then, usually when you come up with your ideas? <laughs> no. no. That's what it's I try to figure out. It's just in the middle and I'm like, how do I do this? Okay. One of the hardest things uh, is figuring out what an artist is talking about. This is the okay. kind of information an artist gives me. Yeah. That's their vision. Yeah. And they say, okay, I have this rock thing and like I want it to spin and people hang on to it. And I have to work through the structural engineering, uh, work through the aesthetics, make sure the artist is happy, um, and then get them build plans. Yeah. So the hardest part is this vision to yeah. going from this to this. Right. And that's a lot of steps. Yeah. That's a lot going on. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. That's great.